Hey diecast fans and collectors, um, over the last, I'd say, week, I picked up this little bunch of cars, um, and I figured I'd just do a video on it, and I'll throw in three of my custom cars, the newest ones I've made in the last couple days, um, and then uh, in the next couple days I'm going out and hunting for more cars, so we'll see, I just want to get them put away, so, um, I figured I'd do a video on them. So, uh, first we're going to start with this color changer right here Boulevard Bruiser I think is what this thing's called pretty cool looking got like blue in it pretty cool looking car front of it's a little bit messed up it looks like yeah it is a little bit but um uh, yeah pretty cool looking car I wanted to do this one first because uh, we're gonna put this guy in the freezer so we can see the other color before the video ends so I'm gonna do that now Okay, and up next I have uh, the Hot Wagons. I found four of them. Obviously, I didn't find the, the one I didn't find is the Datsun. Uh, but I found four of them, which this was the main one I really wanted to find. So I was really happy about that, but I'm going to have to find another one. I'll point that out why in a second. But yeah, the other one I didn't find is the white Datsun up there. The Datsun Bluebird Wagon. So, uh, yeah. Didn't find that one. These are pretty cool. They're metal base, metal uh, chassis. So, pretty cool. Metal base, metal body. Very cool car. I don't know if they've ever made a wagon before. But, uh, yeah, mine's a little bit damaged here at the stripe. Yeah. That sucks. But I want to customize one of these anyway, so it gives me an excuse to buy another one. But, yeah, pretty cool. Pretty cool looking. I think maybe they have made this guy before, but they definitely haven't made it that much. I think maybe they made it in a treasure hunt, super treasure hunt, and like a main line, I think. I think they maybe only made this in like two or three colors, and this might be like the second or the third color of it. I don't know, but pretty cool. GTO wagon. Didn't even know that was a thing until I saw this. Pretty cool. One I wanted to find the most out of the set there and then my second one I wanted to find the most was the Nova wagon and this kind of looks like the mainline one the red one that we saw I think about was it Q case or something or was it a case I don't remember but um yeah pretty cool Nova wagon I love the wheels. I look at them wheels. I wish I'd start putting those wheels on mainline cars. I'd buy a ton of those. Those look awesome. Very nice details. Again, metal base, metal body car. Probably be really fast on the track. Nice green. Very nice. Up next, I've got the Volvo. I'm not doing them in order, I don't think. No, I really don't think I am. The Volvo, probably one of the more easier ones to find is the Volvo and the Audi. Probably the easiest one being the Volvo, I would think. There you go, Volvo. Pretty cool. Been a little bit since we've seen the Volvo wagon. Not too long. I think we just seen them one last year, but we haven't seen one this year yet. Pretty cool to see it again. Volvo. Pretty cool, and it looks like it's a uh, spark plug brand. I have a Toyota with this uh, brand on it, and it's a majorette. Pretty cool. It'd be cool to get a shot of those two together. Yeah, pretty cool. Again, the wheels on this are kind of cool. Not not as cool as the wheels on that uh, Nova and the um, the uh, GTO wagon, but still pretty cool. Okay, up next we've got the 17 Audi RS6 Event. There's more of this one than any of them when I found it. So, 
Yeah. This has pretty neat wheels. I'd like to see them make these on main lines too. Them are pretty cool. Very cool looking wheels. I like the paint job too. It's got like a techno stripe. Something like that. 8 bit stripe. Pretty cool. What does it say on the door? What does it say on the door? Probably says a van or something like that. Pretty cool looking though. I like it. Very cool, especially with those rims. And then that's all the wagons I got. Like I said, I didn't get the uh, Datsun. But I did find some cars from maybe E or F case. Um, not sure what case, but I found four cars. I went to a Myers and looked up by the register, and I found some uh, new cars I haven't seen yet. So um, these are all the ones I they had, or I would have got more. Um, but these are all the ones I could find. So I got this. This is a new model. Um, it flips. Pretty cool. Like a flip car. That can flip down. But yeah, you got it orange on one side. And then it's black on the other. And I think it's a completely different car, too. That one's got exhaust pipes coming out the back of it. I guess that one does too. They both have that, don't they? Are they the same car? Just one has a spoiler and one doesn't? Or one has a spoiler down on the ground and one doesn't? I, I don't know. Something different about them, right? Yeah. But you can do this. You grab this right here. And you turn it. And then the head comes up. Pretty cool. Reminds me of a Leone revolver, if you know what those are. Pretty cool. I like Leone revolvers myself. I think they're pretty cool. Pretty cool Hot Wheels made a, their own take on one of these. I can't wait to see what other colors this guy comes out with in the future. Pretty cool. I like this one. Pretty cool car. Two-sided car. Two cars for the price of one. What? Flip. There you go. There. Dang. I wonder how good it does on the track. I'd try it if I had another one. Like, I'm, I mean a crazy track. And then I found another rest, uh, surf duty right here. I found a blue one. So that was pretty cool. A blue one right here. Beach Patrol. Blue one. Very cool looking. I like the color of this one. Yeah, pretty cool. Beach Patrol. And then I did find one licensed car. Um... Mustang funny car Art car Right there Pretty cool looking silver wheels Pretty neat Wheelie bar Pretty cool I like that one and this one was my actually my favorite fantasy one I found. I just like this one. This was actually the first one I found at that store. Um, it's one of the Brickin Delivery. And it's just really cool. I don't know what I, I like this one so much. Because it's got like, it's just like a van with flames. It, it looks really cool. It's got like 8-bit or, is it 8-bit or 16-bit? 6 bit. No, it's 8. I think it's 8 bit. 8 bit flames on it. Look at that. I just like this a lot. I want a black one of these now so I can put this on it. That'd look cool if I had one that was black with red wheels and then I snap this part on it. That'd be pretty cool. I don't think a black one has come out yet. I have every single one of these brick rides that comes out because I actually like these brick rides. I have a category in my collection just for these brick cars. These are really cool. I love that Hot Wheels is making these. Uh, pretty soon, maybe they'll make a five-pack on these. I wish they'd make a rig, like a, a special brick rig for these guys because that'd be pretty cool to do because they like making rigs that do different things. So it'd be cool if they made a brick rig for these guys. Pretty cool. I love this one. I had no idea this was coming out either. This would have been on my list of one to find, definitely, if I'd have known about it. I just love this one. It's so cool. And then if you want to, you could take that off and look. You got yourself a Diora looking thing. Kind of looks like a Diora. Or if you want to put it back like this. You got a pickup truck. 
a really flat pickup truck. There's a lot of fun stuff you can do with these. I love these brick cars. Put it all the way back here. <laughs> these are so cool. I love these so much. But yeah, uh, just this is probably one of my favorite ones they've made of the brick in delivery. I love this one. It just looks cool. I wonder if uh, the, they. I hope they're gonna come out with another color of this. Um, I know they probably are, but it's still out of the flames on it. It probably will, but I, I don't know what I want. I, I don't know if I want a blue one or if I want a white one or I, I don't know. But I'm definitely not going to search up what the next one is. I love just finding stuff like this that I don't know it's coming out. And then it's like, oh, that's cool. I didn't know that was something that was coming out. Because most of the time I see some cars pop up like on uh, Instagram. When I'm on my Instagram, I see something pop up that people are overhyping. And that's why they're always so hard to find. Um, But uh, yeah, just really cool. I like this one. This is definitely was definitely a nice surprise to find on the pegs. I was like, oh, I love that one. That one's awesome. Just, I really like this one. Probably one of my favorite fantasy models the whole year so far. I love this one. This one looks so cool. But uh, anyways, guys, I figured since there wasn't that many cars, I'd show you guys the Hot Wheels I've made in the last couple days. So uh, I made this one yesterday, right here, just a Civic. You guys remember the video with the Micro Machines? If you watched it, I said I was going to try to imitate that Micro Machine on the back of the box. Well, I tried to... And then I realized the trunk was too small, so I ended up doing like my own design kind of like that for the um, Civic. And this is actually the first Civic I've customized of this type. I thought I customized one already, but I guess I haven't. So, yeah, pretty cool. I like this Civic. It turned out really cool. A lot of people like it, too. My wife likes it. She's like, oh, that's such a pretty color. And it's really cool. I like it. Looks like it could be a premium car or a silver series car or something. Yeah. I like that one. And then I made this one today. And yeah, the wheels are supposed to be like that. <laughs> I did that on purpose. Look at, look at, watch, watch what it looks like when it moves. Isn't that cool? I love that when it rolls. It looks so neat. Well, like I said, guys, I do this for fun. I'm no professional. I just, I know it doesn't look too good, but yeah, it's a pretty cool little car. I was going to do something else with it, and then what I wanted to do with it wouldn't exactly work, so, um... I, I just, I don't know, I didn't have the right tool to do what I want. I wanted to do white outlines around the outside of the spikes, and then I just ended up making it look like slime or something. And I don't know, I, it turned out neat. I love the wheel design. Let's look, look at it when it drifts. Drift car going nuts with the drift. Look at that. Ooh, that looks cool. I love them wheels when they turn. It looks so cool. And then this one, my wife is going to love this when she gets home from work. My lo wife loves silver vehicles. Um, and I made a, one of those um, holiday hot rod uh, Evos into this. I got quite a bit of those just so I could customize them. But yeah, I really, really like this one. This one looked really cool. I was going to make it white because I seen on uh, YouTube someone had customized one in white. And then I was like, I was like, no, nah. I was like, I don't want to copy them. I'm going to do my own thing. And then I was like, you know what? It looked cool if I made it silver with black rims and a black hood. And then, that was also black because that was silver. You can see under there. I didn't bother painting underneath it. I just bothered painting it where you could see it. But yeah, it's really cool. I love this Evo. This Evo is pretty sweet. But yeah, uh, those are three new cars I've made. Um, I've made some colorful ones in the last couple of days. Those two. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I should like to show those to you guys. Um, but anyways, guys, uh, thank you for watching. And uh, in the next few days, I probably should have another video. I have one of those Corvettes on the way. And then I got, uh, I went on eBay and I found a really good deal on some of these. I got six different ones of these for one specific one I've been wanting to find in my collection for a really good price. So I figured I'd just do a video on them and show it to you guys. So um, when that gets here, I'll do that. But anyways, guys, thank you for watching. And uh, one more shot of that car's wheels going. Ooh, look at them wheels. It looks so cool. <laughs>